All right, so I discovered that this LED when off and exposed to light actually generates a small amount of electricity. Earlier, I showed you that it peaks at about 40 volts with this flashlight. To show you that I'm not kidding around. Let's separate all this stuff so you, you know that they, this is all that's in the circuit from the LED to the lower powered LED now normally I would assume that when you fed light into an LED nothing would happen look at that I don't know if I, I, I can tell a little bit on the camera that the LED is glowing. That's a 6 volt LED and it's probably giving it 3 volts. Open circuit seemed to be about 30 volts, which is actually what this thing runs at. This guy is supposed to run at 33 volts. Let's see if we give it more power. That's brighter. I just never would have thought that worked. I probably wouldn't even have found it if I hadn't have gone over the ohm sections and accidentally went to the volts of DC section on that multimeter. That homemade flashlight has is the 50 watt version of this. This is 100 watt. Now, let's plug it into the transformer and feed power to it. Let's see what we get. I need to close my eyes when I connect these. Shield my eyes with the camera. It's hot. I could feel it. I could feel it, the heat from it with my arm right here. And this power supply can only supply 70 watts, so. Well, I have it set up to only power supply 70 watts. That's 32 volts right there. 32 volt and I can't measure the amps because my multimeter isn't working for some reason. Maybe the voltage on the LED is too high. I know. I'll record the 12 volt side.